Hello everyone, welcome to GANs ASP.NET C Sharp tutorial. In this video, we will learn connection string configuration and test connection with SQL Server in ASP.NET C Sharp code using uh, web.config file using the Visual Studio. So, let me open the Visual Studio first. So, I will create one application for the test connection. So, go to the file then go to the new and website select visual c sharp and select empty website in the middle and web website test connection i'm writing the test typical okay click on ok so page is created let me create let me create one page Home.aspx. So for the writing the connection string in the web config, we can write that. So before that, let me open the SQL Server and let create one database. So opening the SQL Server Management Studio, go to the run command and write click on run and just type the ssms sql server management Studio. click on ok so i connected with the sql server database let me create one database new database and tv con test tv con tv connection in the test tv con i'm giving this name to database you click on ok already in another video i already shown you the what is the option and file group and database file and all all the things i already did right? Let me click on ok so database is created okay. so go to the visual studio So this is my web config file. Here I am going to write the connection. So let me connection string then variable is add so name of the connection. So I am going to call the string then connection string is equal to here I have to data source data data source is equal to let me put the local host is catalog is equal to database name so again I have to change get the database name proper database name so copy the database name the id i am putting sa password sa password is there it will be at one two three and this is completed then i have to put the provider is equal to system dot data dot sql so i have written the connection string name is the con string this is very important for that and connection string data source it will show you the 
from the where we are connecting the database so i'm connecting with the local host you can put here local host or dot or your 127.0.0.1 and your system name like go to the so this one the my server name so this is my server name i can put this one also so all will work then initial catalog it refers to the database so this is my database i created the database website test dbcon so this is my database and user id and password as i connected with that database so that user id and password just like go to the connection this is my login id and this is my power here i will put my password so both the things you have to put over there so this is my username password and let me check with the database connected or not i am going to the home page i will run the home page before that i am going to the okay. for so i need some assembly to use the connection so that is the using system dot data dot sql client using system dot data dot system dot configuration these two things I need. I want to just call the connection. You can call here also and inside the function also. So and calling outside. SQL connection call. I'm giving the name if for my choice is equal to new connection connection manager dot connection stream I'm putting here name here I'll put the connection name so connection is to the con string so I'll copy that and put there and there the help so database connection is called here then i have to write some code here so already i have written some code okay, okay. i'm copying this so this is a simple code i'm just opening the connection so let me using system dot data okay so I did this one so con dot open then con dot state connection state dot open is greater than zero mean it is uh, connected to the database so it will show you the connection is okay otherwise I have no connection let me check let me run the home page okay connection is okay okay if I am changing anything on the connection just like a have database I'm changing to one. Let me check. So I'm getting error. So I am unable to open the connection. Means cannot open the database website test phone one test con one i don't have the database test con i have a database website test con db con and i am putting one here so this database is not exist so this is showing that sa is unable to open the database so database is not open so i am getting error so i am so if i will change the sub connection name okay i am changing the con string one here i will also get the error so here, here I'm getting the error. Object different not set to be instance on the object. So both the errors are different. There I'm not able to open the database. Here I am able to open the database, but I'm not able to call that database. So this is one type of connection string. So I have written four types of connection string here. So this one already I did. 
and other I'm doing this so let me check with the other connection string next free type so, this connection string here I am using the con string integrated security SSPI. Here I am not using any user ID and password. See, here I am not using any user ID and password. Let me change the database. Not using. I am using the persistent security info through integrated security SSPI. Okay. And another is integrated security true and remaining things are okay. Means here I am not using any username password. In the last one, I am using only integrated security SSPI, but I am not writing the persistent security info. So all the connection will work. Let me change the connection string name. So on string I am calling into the home.as field where I call and let me replace. Yeah, connection is okay. I'm changing next. So this is also working. Go to the next. Next connection string there. So all types of connection strings are working. There is a four types of connection string I have. So you can use that and we can get it from the our description box also. Thank you for watching.